nighttime. We're getting ready to see my bed. to hunker down. This is my bed. bed. Yeah, we all have our beds. Brooklyn's sleeping in the middle. Jacob's Look sleeping on this bed, colors. and and me and I'm uh, sleeping like over there. The Jacob, show them the dance. Oh. Gabby and Jacob are do this. Everything Jacob knows, Gabby knows. Jacob's like the cool kid in the yeah, crowd. Yeah, watches TikToks. Jacob watches TikToks? Yes. Yeah, oh, that's that's right. 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 Okay, so we are headed out to see Molly's collar in the night. We're going to take a run down to the barn and then come back and be exhausted when we get back. That's what you do when you go to Nana's house. Okay, follow the pink light. Look at the light. The kids have lights on their shoes. <laughs> Light. Yeah, so we got lights everywhere, you guys. Oops, Brooklyn comes right ahead of me. You're going that way? What? No, we don't want Jacob falling down the well. Oh my gosh, I can't see a single thing. Mom, grab your light, Sophia! No, use the light, Sophia. <laughs> I, I swear somebody's gonna hit the ground. Yeah. I think it's gonna be Jacob. <laughs> it's honestly gonna be Jacob or Gabby again. Oh! It was fun. She did it. She kept falling. So, guys, Sophie, keep the light near us. So, basically, oh, Gabby's always been like to have the energy of, of like a five year old boy. Get out of my head. It's so big. <gasps> Brooklyn's got a big head. Right there. Oh, Brooklyn's <laughs> shadow. It's look up in the sky. All right, everybody, look up in the sky. Whoa. Wow. Do you guys see them? Whoa. Whoa. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. What are you doing? It's Brooklyn. It's okay. Jacob, Jacob, Jacob is a terror. Jacob, don't go in that bottle of water. Please do, Jacob. Yeah, please do. Get your socks No. He just had a bath. Everybody just had a bath. Turn on lights. Turn on lights. Turn on lights. I almost walked into a door. <laughs> <laughs> the door that's been there every single day for the last year and a half. Almost two years. Woo, we did it. Oh, I'm cold. Finally, we can see light, but now we need lights to up there. Oh, now you did turn on the lights up there. All right, well, we're not staying. We just came to do a little run, let out some energy, and then we're going to go and get into our beds and we run at the top. Run at the top? Yeah, at the house. Run where at the house? <laughs> 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 I'm, I'm Okay, just wait. I'm sure our neighbors love this. I just did a TikTok they have video. have children, and it's annoying. Shh. And then and they it's... hop their horn in the horn. Jacob, come here. We just did a TikTok with Jacob. It's so funny. <laughs> I feel... Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, this is really happening. <laughs> Jacob. <laughs> Are you scared? Look, don't look behind you. There's a demon. It's Pennywise. Brooklyn, <laughs> <laughs> there's no demon. If anything chases you, it's Molly or Ruby. Or Sophie. Or Gabby, really. Or Gabby. Yeah, we don't like it, Gabby. I'm having story night tonight. because I. When you have a farm, you have to use it. To get all the energy what? out of the grandkids. Daddy okay, the next it. person that screams is going straight to bed. Because people are probably going to call the police. And be like, there's something crazy happening at that house. Uh, we're just I don't kids. think they would. Yeah, they would. Look, we're all holding hands. We're the chicken family. <laughs> Tonight we're going to watch two shows. We're going to watch Twitches. Which is a movie that my girls used to love at Halloween. And then we're gonna watch uh, Add Magic. Just Add Magic, which is Brooklyn's brand new favorite show. Right? 
and we'll fix up our beds. Brooklyn's excited to just lay down and sleep. Do you know how? Do you know? Yeah, and Brooklyn reads books for fun, just like Nana. And her whenever I get bored and I don't want to play the horse set that Nana got me for my birthday, I, or was it Christmas? Christmas. We should do the Christmas. So then she reads. So yeah. Nana gave her a whole bunch of books that are really good. She can take home that are her level. I'm really I'm nice chapter home books. Sack, the sack. Yeah. She, yeah, she loves the Sasha books. All right, Jacob. You ready for sleep, dude? No, 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 no. Yes, we're gonna watch TV. You we look a little tired. We should do the twerk dance. All right, let's do the twerk dance. Twerk. <laughs> Do we have the ones that we Jacob can dance. If you don't notice, Jacob has had some cereal and he is feeling fine. I if you haven't had any breakfast. So you... I had a bad sweep. <laughs> Why did you have a bad sweep? Because I heard car noise and truck noise. <laughs> it's I true. Thought, I thought it was my mommy and daddy. Oh! <laughs> Basically, I slept like not too bad and I heard Jacob and Brooklyn moving around a little But I thought they slept good, but they both said that they they had a, They both said they had a horrible night Brooklyn. Well, how come you had a bad sleep? Because I kept hearing noises and Jacob snoring. Brooklyn, how about your spot on the couch? Did you pick a good spot? Why? I, I can my feet wouldn't like I didn't have enough room it's true, they said they had a horrible sleep. I had great sleep. We're headed out to the apple orchard. If you didn't hear what Jacob was saying, he was saying that he has gone to the blueberry orchard with his, with Stacy's parents, and today we're going to the apple orchard with their dad's parents, us. First order of business, thank you guys so much for entering. I'm tired, I wanna go back to bed. I'm tired. Thank you guys so much for entering into Bye, our good contest. Good night, good night. Good night. Comment below if you think Jacob would be an awesome YouTuber. I think Jacob should have his own channel. Do you guys think Jacob should have his own channel? He's super entertaining. Anyways, thank you guys so much for entering our contest. We're gonna pick Brooklyn and Jacob. We're gonna pick three winners. He does like to move it, move it. Anyway, we're headed out. Um, we're gonna pick the winners later, and we're gonna introduce you to our next giveaway. Super exciting. Um, we'll catch you guys all up on that a little bit later in the vlog. But for now, we're gonna go out and do some fun Halloween Thanksgiving themed stuff. We were gonna bring the puppies and then Sam said Jacob is enough puppies. <laughs> Jacob is enough enough puppies to bring anywhere because he is full of life. We're at the uh, uh, apple orchard. We're at the apple orchard. Jacob, where are you? Yeah, he's missing for me. Yeah, he's always missing. Here, hold my hand. No. Okay, don't hey, go so, close to people. Um, I did you one better. Okay, you did me one better. I bought better. my own money because I knew oh. there were treats here, so you don't have to pay for them. Oh, that's so sweet. Because I like to spend money. Yeah, let me spend my money and you save your money because you're saving for a bridal. There's some sheep and some chickens. We'll go over there and we'll see them. I see the sheep. I love this. I'd like to have like a little enclosure like this. All right, obviously morning is the time to come because we are here, we're waiting to go on a wagon ride and we're next in line, like we're first in line basically. And there's nobody behind us. The kids are over there in the playground. I've seen Sophie over there with her hair in a bun though and a backpack on, like being a teenager kind of almost. It's just so weird for me. Like I can't even recognize that she belongs with our group. And Jacob is living it up. <laughs> Wanna shake the ground, wanna break away, let loose I'm tired of waiting, gotta make that move All the neon signs, now they shout to me and you To write our story, wanna shape the news
Sophie got her Just Ride weekend goal shirt. It's from Halter Equestrian. Yeah. I love you it. New mask. Yeah, you need a new mask. Yeah. It's gonna be here really soon. We're waiting. Oh, baby boy, he said hi to me, so I said hi back. Aww. Is he adorable? Is he adorable? No. Put it back. Oh, I'm loving your the, your Can vibe. Eat that apple. Don't eat the apple. Don't touch it. Oh, I hear a wagon. We're getting the blue tractor, Jacob. Look at the back row. I'm right beside Nina, Jacob. Oh, I should hold on. I should sit next to Nick, Jacob. Sometimes when you're the busiest person, you need to be closest to the adult. You got get my meaning? Oh, the guy gave us like the rules about what not to do. What did he say don't do, Jacob? I, I don't say eat apples. He said don't fall off. It's, yeah. it's not fun, but it is funny. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna go on this wagon ride and we're gonna get to pick apples. It's gonna be super fun. Yeah. Look at how pretty. <laughs> Jacob, you have to go to the bathroom? <laughs> yeah, he'd probably say yes. <laughs> I mean, no. Because it's pretend. Well, tell them the other TikTok that you know and like. I want to move it, move it. I want to move it. <laughs> like, I want to move it on the tractors. I want to move it on the tractor, tractor, the tractor. <laughs> but you're not allowed to. You're not allowed to. <laughs> Whoever knew I'd have such gifted grandkids. How to sneak an apple, but we're not actually gonna sneak an apple. We're just gonna we're allowed this to pick really one. Nice. Okay, let's show them. Okay. Okay. So this is what you have to do. You put it in your backpack. No, no, no. Come on, let's show them. So get your apple and then you you put it on your head. And then you Wait, we don't have time. No, he's not even giving us time. I'm just being chill with it. And then you put your bun. So basically, that is how. You, I think you're only allowed one, but one. We'll, let's go. Okay, just wait. I need to get an apple. Let's see, you see the best apple? Is it this one? All right, and I'm gonna get one for Gabby. Sam couldn't wait. Eat all the apples. You don't like it? Do you want me to take it out? No. Okay, let's go. Okay. You think anybody will notice? <laughs> yeah. Mm, the apples are so good. You like your apple, Jacob? Yum. Yeah. Like we're eating apples. Yeah, everybody's eating an apple. I think we're hitting the pumpkin patch next. We are entering the spooky corn maze. Spooky. Oddly enough, I feel like we're taller than the corn. So one of the things that Jacob loves is scary things. Like he's obsessed with horror movies and scary. This is like his dad. So I'm gonna go and tell everybody that we're gonna hide slowly, hide in the corn. And then when all of a sudden, at one point, Jacob's gonna turn around and everybody's gonna be gone. So that's what my goal is. See if we can scare the heck out of him. Back down, back down. <laughs> Makes me have to pee too. Shh, okay, be quiet. Let's see what he notices. Is it bright? Sit down. Shh, don't go. Uh oh. Guys, are you coming? Guys, are you coming? Guys! Shh, don't go. Oh, shut up. Where are you? Lunch. That sucked. We, we thought we would spook you. Were you nervous when we weren't there? I guess that I'm a ninja and there's blood on it. Okay, you guys, he's a ninja and there's blood on that thing. <laughs> These are bad guys. It makes me forget what having a boy is all alike, all about. Everybody needs one little boy in their life, I'm telling you now. Okay, don't wreck them. That's what they need for growing corn. To be honest, I feel like there comes a point in life when your kids get older that you kind of stop doing 
this kind of stuff that you love, like going for walks in the woods and doing the haunted corn maze and and wagon rides. Like there comes a time when you stop doing it, you just stay home and do nothing. That's what grandkids are for. They keep you young. All right, so they have caramel apples. All the photo ops here. Like this would be such a great spot. Jacob, sit there and let me take a picture of you. Oh, can I sit there? Yeah, go ahead on the big scale. Wait, it might weigh you. <laughs> okay, so we are now picking apples. We each got a bag. Now we need two of the other ones. Well, what about uh, mommy and daddy? Oh, yeah. We need four. Mommy and daddy. These are the ones that we picked on the wagon ride. They were yummy. Why don't you get a couple of these ones, Jacob? Yeah. Oh, Jacob, you're going to drop that. Why don't you get a couple of these ones, love? Put them in your bag to take home. You gotta fill that bag right up. Sophie stuffed our bag so full. Brooklyn's fitting one last apple in her bag. Can she do it? Can you do it? So we're gonna take some apples home and they're gonna take some apples home. Did you guys have fun? Yeah, yeah I'm shining my apple. Are you? Look at all the leaves in the horse paddock. Whoa. Whoa. This is Gracie's apple. I didn't finish it. Yeah. Woo! Scary. Things are changing so much, you guys. Like, you know what I spend my time doing now? Like, any spare second that I have to just sit around and do nothing and watch videos, I watch horse training videos. Like, who ever thought that I would be watching horse training videos? But I do because I'm so excited. Like, I'm learning so much. All right, let's do it. Freezing cold outside. No, it's not. And Brooklyn is not freezing cold. <laughs> Willow's nose. You can see Willow's nose. Oh, that's Willow. And we got dogs on this side, horse on this side. What, what do you think will happen when we open the door? They'll run. They just run right by her now. But like my big dilemma right now that I'm trying to think about what should I do. So a Tennessee walking horse, like I told you, they're the mollies of the horse world. They like to move it, move it. Like Jacob, they like to move it, move it. And I don't like, Stella was great in this small paddock. In fact, our that loved Stella in this paddock because she had like issues and it was just good for her when we first brought her home anyway. Um, so I could like put her in this big field here and let her be next to the ponies. I don't want to bring her here and then introduce her to the ponies like I did with the last horse that I brought home accidentally by mistake because it was just a nightmare. It was like a total nightmare. I wanted her to be alone but I don't know if she'd like feel comfortable being I don't know if she's the kind of horse that would be okay being like next to the ponies but I don't want to like I ideally didn't want to bring her home to this farm because it's not really set up in a way that I wanted to have it set up for her that apple is from your girl Gracie not only did she think to give it to you but she also remembered to bring it down when we came it's juicy so we are gonna do a super fun little ride again because Brooklyn be wanting to ride her pony I worked so hard this summer to get the ponies like at a good weight and she was such such a good weight and then I can't like be here every single second like I feel like my whole family has to help sometimes but I can't let them control the food because they don't they they just throw and don't think Brooklyn lived here I take her out every single morning or every single day and let her have a ride until she's so comfortable. Like already in two days, she's so comfortable. home I could put the ponies in here and lock her out there which might even be better what do you think about that as an idea her in there and outside. her inside yeah. Ollie's upstairs. yeah maybe that's better because can you close the door are you taking her in there yeah okay I need somebody to hold Willow we moved inside because of the grass issue and then Jacob's doing poop patrol because he loves yeah. Yeah. Um, that was a fail. You think Brooklyn should canter her? Yeah. Gabby's looking at me. We're looking at Brooklyn. Should we do it? This mama's heart says no. Wait, wait, wait. Are you doing it? 
Wait, wait, wait. You have to tell her how to hold on. Oh my god, I didn't know. I do not think this is a good idea. Do not think this is a good idea. Tell us when you want to stop. Do you like the bumpy? Oh my god. Oh my gosh. So. So what do you do if you want her to stop? Lean back. Okay, stop. I know. I don't think Brooklyn, I think Gracie knows that Brooklyn isn't balanced enough yet. She's holding on just fine. You want to canter? It's just one step past what she's doing right now. Yeah. It is Jacob's turn. Can't believe Brooklyn almost cantered. Brooklyn, you almost cantered. You fast trotted. You fast trotted and you did awesome at it. Don't let her nibble your fingers. The last time I tried it was not the right fit, like for me at all, and I knew that. And I know that I felt pressured. It was hard. It was just a bad situation. But one thing I learned from it, and which is probably like why it happened, is that I have to have like a big plan about how I'm gonna bring another horse here. I have to have a plan already in place so that I can introduce the horses slowly because I know that Willow is bossy. And so uh, how this plan has to work is that I have to introduce Gracie and her together first and I want to do it slowly I want to let them have time to get used to each other like before I introduce them because it can get scary it can get crazy and our setup is not awesome so that's why I'm working on this week you guys because at the end of this week coming up like this week that's when I'm going to go and see her and if I put that horse on the trailer it will only be because I know that I'm going to keep her like that's it like I'm not bringing her home thinking like oh maybe it will work I think it could work if I, there's what if I am the least bit scared to ride her like this much scared to ride her she's not coming home with me even if I have to go back and try her again like this is like gonna be serious business serious business you guys so yeah tell me comment below what you guys think that I should do anyway we're gonna go up to the house I'm gonna draw names for the winners of today's prizes and then I'll let you know what tomorrow's prize is gonna be. Brooklyn and Jacob, we're gonna both pick winners for today's giveaway and then we're gonna announce tomorrow's giveaway. All right, Jake, Brooklyn, are you ready? This is what I want you to do. I want you to go like this and scroll and then stop and pick one. Um, I'm back. Okay, Jacob, whoops. Just wait, Jacob. Jacob is back. All right, Jacob. I forgot to comment. Oh. Sophie forgot to comment. Sophie, you lost. Don't worry guys, we're not gonna do that at the same time every day and sometimes I'm gonna wait a couple of days to do a draw on like bigger prizes so that more people have a chance to get in. But I don't, I like two. but I want this give. I want these giveaways to go like to our that. actual true fans, like people who follow us all the time. So, okay, all right, let's see. Allie B. Allie B, <laughs> she says, done. Don't worry about how big or small your prizes are. It's so kind that you guys are even doing this in the first place. Those treats look absolutely stunning. Good luck to you all. So um, she's gonna um, win um, um, one um, of the treats. All right, Brooklyn's gonna do one more. Sophie will be doing a lot of them. Okay, get over here, it's your turn. All right, are you ready? Jacob's doing it again. Okay. Oh my God. So the next winner is Rachel Powell. Rachel Powell, she commented 13 hours ago. Mm. Uh, she said, done. Even if I'm not one of the lucky three people to get the horse treats, I may even buy my own treats from Horse and Around Treats. 
because their products look good quality and I'm sure my horse Sweetie would love them. Thank you day by day for introducing them. So you guys saw that I'm not even interfering at all. I'm just letting the girl, or I'm just letting the kids pick a winner. Just wait, the next one's for, for Jacob. Okay, so look, I want you to put, do this with your finger and push it and then pick a winner. Like this? No, not that, on the phone. See, look at what I'm doing. See, I'm, I'm scrolling and you I'm, I'm should have commented first. Or All right, you tell me when you pick one. Keep going, he's going nice and slow, you guys. All right, so, oops, <laughs> then, whoa, oops. Oh my goodness. Okay. So the last winner is K Productions and all she all she commented was done and that's all you have to con comment. So K Productions, she's the last winner for today's giveaway. So tomorrow's giveaway. We picked it Brooklyn and I. What are we giving away Brooklyn tomorrow? We are oops, giving, giving away, away from the company Halter Equestrian. Do you want to show them what they're going to get? They're going to get a little like phone thing. Pop socket. Then they're going to get a little um, socks. Socks. You guys are going to get riding socks from Halter Equestrian. You know the company that came, did the photo shoot with us and we shared some of their fall line with you guys? Well, these socks are Halter Equestrian riding socks. They're blue. They have horses jumping on them and they're made from dreamers and schemers a lot of you guys know that they're super nice socks i'd like a pair my own on my i'd like a pair myself probably most of you are already following halter equestrian but this is what you're gonna win you're gonna get the bag you're gonna get the socks you're gonna get the pop socket i'm gonna go ahead and show them some love follow their instagram page come back and put done and you could win a pair of socks and a pop socket we'll see you guys later Bye. 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 Don't you know that you're beautiful?